One of the smallest nations in the world, Andorra has been independent for more than 1,000 years and was an autonomous co-principality for more than seven centuries. Despite the transformations that neighboring European countries have undergone over the centuries, Andorra has managed to preserve its mountain tranquility and medieval traditions as well as a stable political system. Area 180 square miles, 468 square kilometers. Population, 2020 est. 782,000. Landscape. Comprising an alpine landscape of high peaks and deep valleys on the southern slopes of the Pyrenees, Andorra is bounded on the south and west by Spain and on the north and east by France. The physical setting prohibits air transportation. No railway system exists, but good roads link Andorra with France and Spain and permit access by car to the most secluded spots. The climate is generally dry, with heavy rainfall in spring and autumn and abundant snow that remains for several months in the highlands. Temperature varies greatly, depending on altitude. In the highlands are typical small Andorran villages, with their houses of granite, wood, and slate. In the valleys are the larger villages, where economic growth has brought modern buildings that contrast sharply with the traditional architecture. The largest villages are Andorra La Vela, the capital, and Escalds, which has a hydroelectric station and sulfur springs. The Andorrans, mostly of Spanish origin, are predominantly Roman Catholic. Catalan is the official language. Public services. The French and Spanish governments shared jurisdiction over the co-principality from 1278 to 1993. They provided some public services, including postal, telegraph, and schools. Catalan-speaking children are taught in both foreign languages. No national monetary unit existed, instead, the euro, the currency of France and Spain, is used. In 1969 mandatory social insurance went into effect, covering illness, disability, and old age pensions. A new constitution adopted in 1993 changed the co-principality status. This change gave new obligations and powers of taxation to Andorran officials. Economy. Andorra's principal agricultural products are potatoes, cereal, and tobacco. Minerals include iron, lead, and alum. Sheep and other livestock are raised. Since the 1950s the state has been affected greatly by a profound change from the traditional pastoral and farming economy to one of commerce and year-round tourism. With the economic expansion, several banks have been established in association with French and Spanish investment firms. The population has increased dramatically, but much of this increase has been the result of immigration from neighboring countries. By the early 21st century nearly two-thirds of Andorra's population was foreign-born. In addition, Andorra receives more than 10 million tourists each year. History and Government Andorra has survived as an independent state since the earliest period of European history. In the year 819 Louis the Pious, a son of the Emperor Charlemagne, gave the land belonging to the Counts of Urgell, in Spain, to the Bishop of Urgell. Andorra's independence traditionally has been attributed to this grant. In 1278, the principality was placed under joint control of the French Count of Foix and the Spanish Bishop of the See of Urgell. This dual allegiance was interrupted only during the French Revolution in the late 18th century. From the late 13th century, although Andorra was governed jointly by the Spanish Bishop of Urgell and the President of France, the state has maintained its original status of neutrality. In March 1993, the citizens voted to adopt a new constitution that greatly reduced the power of French and Spanish authorities. The government is administered by the General Council, or Parliament. Its 28 members are elected for four-year terms. Suffrage has been universal since 1970, when women received the right to vote, but the non-citizen majority cannot vote. 